I knew they were going to come again. headed for the main gate. I know another way. Yeah? You come in with us then. If you're to save your house, you'll need more than the two of us at your side. You'll need an army. That's hmm. why you're here, isn't it? To hire one. An army of cell swords and a man to lead them. Okay. Do you hear what I'm saying, boy? I can lead an army. I know you can. I've always known it. Your father was blind to that. Hmm. None of that matters without cell swords to hire. And all the companies around here are engaged. Hmm. What about Croft? One-eyed Croft with the second sons. They're all with the Targaryen girl now. Right. Croft owes me a favor. I'm pretty sure he hates you, actually. No. He'll help us. I'll make sure of it. And how are you going to do that? We didn't part on the best of terms. I'll be charming. <laughs> Right. <laughs> I'm very charming. God, you're all afraid. Well, this mother of dragons and her cell swords are headed north, so we make for Marine. Wait, Marine? Shit. What? Oh. Unfinished business there. I don't want to talk about it. We can't afford any distractions. It's not your problem. Just don't bring her. It'll be fine. I promise. Besky, you don't have to come. You could head to Astapor or even Car. No, I'm coming. All right. Nothing there I can't handle. <gasps> ah, run! Ponte Renas. Nunca he no si botagon costoti daor. I hope you had well. Well, yeah, well, I guess. Uh oh. Go. Fuck. No, 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 no. Don't. He's probably going to turn around. Yes, thank God. Whew, that was gambling right there. Just one more we'll have to kill later. Let's go. You did well back there, Asher. You acted like a true leader. Cool. You two can talk about it later. I'm a leader. to get out of here. <laughs> they won't stop looking for us. I know. It's a long journey to Marine on foot. I hope you're ready, Asher. It won't be easy. Let's just get that army. I'm ready. All right. Good lad. Either we cross the narrow sea with an army at our backs, or House Forester will not survive to see winter. Oh boy. They're getting armies from everywhere now, though. From Asher, from Marjor, maybe. Well, indirectly, but. Good dog. Was it that guy again? The the coal um What do you call him? Coal boy? I don't know. I can't even go check it out, really? Peak. Yeah, let's call. Hello? Of course not. Why would you bust in? Just open. Is that her? No, who's her missus? Yes. Yes, okay. The fuck? 
That's what I thought. Eh. Wait, so is stuff missing? Mm, yes. Everything's still here. Oh, they changed it then. They just looked through it. There's something the under- from my family. What would someone want with them? There's something under there. Or maybe it was just clipping textures. Fuck. Was someone going through my books? Someone was going through everything. Is there anything wrong on the other side? Well, okay, this one. Why would someone do this? Okay, alright. Wait, 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 there's scruff marks. Huh. That's... Weird. Yes. Wow, this thing moves. Alright, let's read this. I think it's that coal boy, but I don't freaking know. I have information that will aid you with the imp. Meet me in the gardens at midnight. Okay. I mean, I'd assume he came in, tried to find something to write really quick, but I don't know, why, there. how would that explain? Oh, that should last through Lady Elena's visit, at least. We'll There's been no news from Mira. She may not have found a way to help with Elena. We'll be fine, Mother. I pray you're right. Lord Glenmore's army could keep us from ruin. Oh, come on. But Elena must still agree to the marriage. <clears throat> My lord, you might remind Lady Elena that in terms of lineage, you are still very much a man. Yes, Maester. What I mean is, if the two of you wanted to produce an heir, it should not be a concern. I'll make sure she knows. It cannot hurt. Most ladies her age. Enough, Maester. Just remember that she'll want to see gentleness in you too. Yes. I don't mean to burden you with unwanted advice, but this is an important day for all of us. Thank you, Mother. This advice well taken. All I'm right. just so glad to see you home. My lord, Let me at it. She's here. Let's charm the living shit out of her. Whew. I am actually a little nervous. <laughs> Roderick? Huh. Oh, I'm sorry. You look... You're really... Welcome to Ironrath, Elena. It's good to see you. Where are my courtesies? It's good to see you too. Da. Please. She's much more at ease. Alright, let's do this. So, Charming. here we are. I'm glad to see you up and about. How have you been, Elena? Oh, it's been quiet, I suppose. Times have certainly been difficult, but I'm well. Thank you for asking. No problem. I set out for Ironrath as soon as I heard you were alive. My father suggested I wait, but I can't believe it's been two years. Your brother's name day feast. We danced until the sun came out. Ah. <laughs> But now your house prepares for a funeral. And you... Tell me the truth, Roderick. How are you, really? And please, be honest with me. I don't mean to pry, but... I'm getting better every day. Might be a while before we dance again, though. <laughs> I'm glad to hear you're recovering. So much has changed since we were children. Playing hide-and-seek in the grove and... <laughs> so easy to find. You always in behind the same tree. <laughs> Maybe I wanted you to find me. Ah! I'm such a charming fucker. <laughs> Roderick. I am. Um, 
I need to ask you something. Okay. When I arrived at Ironrath today, your courtyard was filled with drunken soldiers. White Hill soldiers. They said some terrible things. The White Hills are your oldest enemies, Roderick. Why are they here? Has something happened? We weren't given a choice. Those soldiers are here at the orders of the Bolton. That's horrible. Bruce Bolton must mean to occupy Iron. No. Mm -mm. He just wants to assure our loyalty. I'm going to be honest with you, Roderick. Okay. I have always looked forward to our marriage. But? But in light of all that's happened to your family... My father is questioning the wisdom of our betrothal. Mm-hmm. He wants me to call it off. That's what I thought. And what do you want? I've been asking myself the same question. And frankly, I'm torn. I don't care about your scars, Roderick. I love the boy you were. And I can love the man you are. Mm-hmm. But my family can't get drawn into a war with the Boltons. Mm. They're the Wardens of the North. And they flay their enemies. My house is stronger than it looks. Every one of us is fighting to survive. Even beyond Ironrath. <sighs> it's good to hear you so assured. But I have <laughs> to be practical. Lena. It doesn't matter how we feel. Aww. How can I ask my father to risk everything? Even for you. Because I love you, Elena. Roderick. I wish that was enough. God damn it, I should have gone with Dad and would. But I have to think of my family. I'm going to tell Father the betrothal is off. Ugh. If it helps, we can delay the announcement. It'll give you time to get your affairs in order. Deepest apologies, my lord. I tried to stop him, but- Yo, the rumors uh. are true. Great timing. You have no right to just. And if it isn't Elena Glenmore, you're not still marrying into this wretched family. My father has not yet made a decision. Fuck well, you. For what it's worth, you can do much better than this cripple. And my son Griff needs a bride. Get out now! How rude of you! Your mother's the one who invited me here. What? That's not true. I sent a raven to Lord Whitehill about letting Brian attend the funeral. Mm -hmm. But I never expected him to barge in like this. Oh, she practically begged me to come. No, she wanted Brian to come. the same in her position. The youngest son hung to mourn his dead father and brother. What sort of a game are you playing, Whitehill? I just want to be certain that you know your place. Fuck you already. Lord Ramsay ordered your family to obey my soldiers until my son Griff arrives from Harrenhal. But now I hear you're ordering them around and keeping them dull on wine. It makes me start to question your obedience. They wanted wine, I gave them what? Enough of this. Fine. Let's talk this through. How about I talk and you fucking listen? Of course. He loves to hear himself sure. talk. Here's the idea. We're going to make a fresh start, you and I. Huh? Your brother Ethan was a dismissive little shit. But you're a different man entirely, aren't you? What? But so, Ethan... if you want Ryan at that funeral, show Lady Elena you respect your betters. Kneel and kiss my shiny ring. Hell no. Just do it, Roderick. Ugh. You don't want to end up like your brother, do you? Fine. Please. It means nothing, and we'll get to see Ryan again. I. Ethan bent the knee, and you still killed him. Very good. Now then, since you're a loyal subject, I'll need you to pay me a tribute. Huh? 
I'm taking what should have been mine in the first place. What, his bride? The other half of the Ironwood Forest. You can't do Ramsay that. Snow I said... know what Ramsay said. I'm saying something else. The fuck? As of today, I harvest Ironwood from wherever the fuck I please. And you can't do a bloody thing to stop me. Would you defy an express order from House Bolton? I've known Roos Bolton my whole life. As long as he gets his ironwood, he won't care. Ah, oh, this is getting so Especially tense, man. Tell him you've sworn to obey that me. was a sign of respect, not an oath. Well, I have what I came for. I'll leave you to your business. Yeah, I'm here. I was gonna have to bend this. Well, Tyrion. By the way, my men have a name for you. Roderick the Ruined. Isn't that clever? Ah, ha, 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 ha. you're so mature. Ah, ha, ha. I can't believe you would submit to him like that. I know you had your reasons, but... You don't want to marry him anyway. He deserve your obedience. I did it for Ryan. Maybe I'd have done the same. Yeah, you would. My lord, are you well? I don't know. Seven fucking hours. All right, achievement, love and hostility. Jesus, talking, it's a thing. Hey, Garrett. Oh, fuck. Ugh. You can't be fighting with the other recruits. You need those men to have your back. Yes. There's enough out here trying to kill us without trouble amongst our own. You're right. I'm sorry. I'm Garrett. Frostfinger told me about you. <laughs> Seems to think you might be trouble. He doesn't know me. He's seen a thousand recruits pass through those gates. He knows you better than you think. <laughs> I'm not really trouble. He said... You fought for the North with the Foresters. Yes. You were there. At the Twins. Hmm. Yes. I still don't understand. Three thousand men, and not one could save my brother. Why didn't anyone fight back? Why didn't they rally to their king? Nobody was expecting it. One minute we were drinking and telling jokes, and, and the next... The phrase cut us open. Those cowards. Mm -hmm. Couldn't face Rob like men, so they stabbed him in the back. They couldn't even give him an honorable death. Let him die fighting. Walder Frey and Roos Bolton will pay for their treachery. I'd like to believe you, but men like that don't get what they deserve. Oh, yeah, he will. They now will. the Freys command River Run, and the Boltons are wardens of the North. After what they did, it's not right. They murdered my family. I should have been there. I keep thinking if I'd been there, I could have done something. Hmm. But chances are, I'd be dead too. Whatever I once thought, my place is here. With the nice watch. Oh. Well, I'm glad we get to interact with him a little bit. So this is how it looks up here. There were those here who will hate you for who you are. Mm -hmm. Southerners who will call you traitor. Northerners who will call you craven. Some won't even have a reason. They'll hate you anyway. You can't mm -hmm. do anything about it. That's life. Trust me, I know. 
I don't care if they hate me. Let them think what they like. Ignoring them won't be as easy as you think. Yeah, well... Most of the men are criminals forced to take the black. You were a squire for a noble house. What happened to you today happened to me more times than I can count. I learned there's nothing more important than having brothers you trust. Mm. Oh. 